What's the password? Can I come in? Nah, that ain't it. Hey, groovy guys and gals, cats and kittens, look at this. Whew, this is the Hot Truck Series for 2022. Now, these... I was lucky to find at least two of each of these, which is nuts, and these are honorary mentions, and this was from last year's Hot Truck Series. Who knew? <laughs> you ready to take a close look? I know I am. Let's do this! Hey, cats and kittens, it's a toy car case event at Johnny Roman's Supper Club. It is 316 on old Johnny Clock. Let's see what pulled into our parking lot. Now you know old Johnny likes his semi-trucks and pickups too, if they're really cool. Now, these are honorary mentions of the Goodyear. Look at this thing. This is part of the Hot Wheel Metro series. I love this. This is totally classic cool. You've got the Goodyear Tampo all the way around which is very sweet. It is a 2009 Ford F-150. Is that nice or what? Here is your case number. If it focuses. Now I've got a bunch of these and they might go out to other people. And I found this which was a retro leftover which is a 79 Ford Ranger or 19 2019 Ford Ranger Raptor which is a very cool Ford truck for the Ford man 57 Ford man go check them out hot trucks but someone thank God pointed out to me that the corner is different and this was from last year so very cool on those but let's get into these this is one of ten cars now Usually, I do not collect a full series of cars. I usually don't even go into the stores because <laughs> it's so discouraging to get into the store and just find nothing. I don't find treasure hunts. I was hoping so today. This is why I'm doing the video because I stopped in a store and they had four cases of cars, the stand-up uh, displays. And I'm like, holy crap, maybe I'll get a... Uh, my golden duck treasure hunt or maybe just any treasure hunt but <laughs> no such luck but I did find some cool stuff so I just wanted to show you this is a 2020 Ram 150 Rebel or 1500 Rebel look at that I'm telling you very nice now again I was finding cars literally just about 20 minutes ago <laughs> Now, I love this the Mazda, the Riku, Ripu, <laughs> I don't know what that is, but in this series, some of these cars are just very clean, very not crazy like I normally like them, but look at the details on this. This is pretty sweet. Now. People are picking up these trucks left and right. Now, I wish this was a super treasure hunt or something goofy goober like that, but uh, not on this one. So, this is number two of ten cars. Look at that. I'm digging that. Again, just a very nice clean. Now, here was my amazing find, and I found the first ones like a week and a half ago. This is number three. It is a Hot Wheel Hot Truck, Tesla Cyber Truck. Now, when this first came out, I never even came close to seeing them. And I just almost filled my pants when I saw the first one on the shelf. And I only saw one in a store, and I ran to another store, and there was a second one. Well, today, there were four more which I nabbed them all! I was a greedy son of a guy! <laughs> Sorry about that. And I went to another store and nothing. But look how cool this is. Now I'm going to keep some and I'm going to send some to Soda Pop. Because he's starting to collect. Sucker, don't do it! 
but I was very, very excited to find this and then realize it's part of the Hot Truck series. And that was probably the car that I was thinking that it would be the hardest to find. All you have to do is subscribe and you can see all the cars you had as kids. Come to one event, come to them all. We've got videos all the time. Subscribe, subscribe on our YouTube channel at Toy Car Case. Oh, I get so excited when the toy cars come out. Johnny Roman coming to a supper club near you. Check out the Toy Car Case YouTube channel and subscribe. No animals were hurt during the filming of this commercial. <laughs> However, several cars were obliterated. Here is number a four of ten. It's a Toyota. Look at this thing. Toyota Tacoma. And again, just really nice representation of these. Look at the details on these. It is kind of nice. Which, again, I really nice, clean, just simple pickup. <laughs> and I got two of those. Then this one, which has a treasure hunt, which I don't have, but I looked. Trust me, I looked. So, this one, when I first saw it, a Studebaker, a 63 Studebaker champ. This one is just a gorgeous car. This is number five of ten cars. And look at this. I love when they put the cover over the back so you don't have all that weird um, metal and plastic combo. But the color combo on this is just beautiful. Really nice all around. Loving every bit of that. Then... Look at this, Netflix, Fast and Furious Spy Racers. Now, do you guys follow it? This is Jeb Clampett. I don't know who that guy is. Anyways, it's a hot truck series, and it's a Rally Baja Crawler. Kind of cool on its own, but again, I don't watch this series, so I'm not quite sure on who this guy is. But that's who he is. He is like, I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. But this is number six of 10. Again, graphics are good, wheels are good, tires are good on this. Very nice piece, pull it out, and you got good as gold. Now, number. Seven. Look at this. This one is just fantastic. Whoever designed this and the tampo on it, fantastic. Look at that low stance on this. This is an 83 Chevy Silverado with a custom grill on that. Look at that. I am telling you, just gorgeous. Now this is what I was talking about, how the the beds are usually just garbage so I don't know do you do you print out something on a little sheet of flat plastic and cut it to fit perfectly in there I have no idea the back is shaved so you got nothing no details on those tail lights you do have a rear exhaust dual exhaust which is pretty sweet but again very nice piece I got three of these I left a couple behind on the shelf today but very gorgeous. Look at that. Totally loving that. Be a cool kid on the block. Tell all your friends. So don't let your days be boring and wasted away. Come to the supper club and play. Everyone is crowding and heading towards the supper club. Join us. Subscribe now. Don't you wish you had that? This is the place to be! Cause life starts after 316! Then, this one is new for 2022. It is a fantasy car. 
which I know most of you guys don't like. This is number 8 of 10. <laughs> it is a goofy goober. It's the Lolex, which I have no idea what that means. But if you look kind of close, not too bad. Almost like an off-road racer Baja thing with low-cut doors. Not a ton of detail on it. But again, it's part of a series. And uh-oh, I hope I don't get stuck in. I gotta get every one of the series. Because I will go berserk in this area trying to find all of them. Because you know what? The dealers <laughs> and the flippers are just ruthless in this area. This is number 9 of 10. And look at this. This is La Troca. Look how gorgeous this is. Now I have three of these, which I'm very grateful to find three. But in the store today, in, in this big uh, series of pallets of uh, displays, there were two or three of these. So I left those behind, even though this is a quick pickup. Just because it's so gorgeous gold with white trim and a darker gold uh, piece on that. Look at that. I'm telling you. They're starting to hit the air, the, some of the stores in the Chicago area. I've got three of those. And then last but not least, number 10 of 10. And this is a goofy goober one. The Renan Rig. Look at that still cool oh look look at the reflections on that on those seats nice chrome seats so again if you want to find these cars they're out there but let me tell you you are going to be looking hard and long and you just got to keep hitting over and over again and asking and all sorts of stuff like that. I did finally find the original Batmobile, the TV series Batmobile, Batman, which, again, if you're anywhere near my age, this was the coolest car in the world and Batman was the coolest. <laughs> so, I grabbed a couple of these and... Uh, I did get the, the first series when they first initially released these. I know Barris was having a, a long, hard fight with them on the trademark name, and they couldn't use the trademark name, and I think he owned... So, look, I got six of those. But he owned the trademark on those, and so they were fighting over it. I should turn these around so you can actually see them. Is that a better way? I know, when you go to the flea markets, they, they, they turn them around, but you can't see the cars because they're, you only see the bottoms. And this way, at least you can see the tops. These Teslas, gorgeous. And I don't know if, like I said, they are hitting the stores right now. I literally found four today. So I'm just doing this video right away. I got other videos to do ahead of these. But I wanted to just let you guys and gals, cats and kittens know that the uh, they're starting to hit the shelves. And, and I'm sure people are going to be nabbing them up by the hundreds, you know, hitting all the different things. So with these, do you have a favorite? Now for me... Even before the Tesla, I think, is this one. I mean, just the colors on it is just spectacular. Love the Tesla just because I never got one in the first round. It's like the drag bus. Never got one. <laughs> but eventually I got like an aftermarket side one. But I never got one of the original Hot Wheel ones, which would be cool. But you know what? That's why I started collecting the old ones. Now, the cool thing is, I got a collection from a guy that's 44 years old that we're gonna be showing you pretty soon. 
and I've got some more new ones as well as Miss K's birthday which was on Tuesday ha <laughs> happy birthday Miss K so I hope you had a good birthday and uh, so anyways I got a lot of videos to show you I'm interrupting our Arizona trip to put this in just to let you know that if you're looking for Tesla's they're in the stores right now so in the Chicago area so look out for them I mean you can find cars at grocery stores at drug stores at dollar stores dollar generals you can find them at Target Kmart Kmart is gone Walmart now Kmart has all those special cars special additions to Kmart only which are very cool however <laughs> Again, I am yet to find one because they're in there as soon as the store opens or after it's done and I'm pretty wiped out by that time or I'm at work at 6.30 or 6 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> so, there it is, the Hot Truck Series from 2022. Oh, uh, tell me what you like, what you're doing, what you're collecting. Uh, I'd love to hear from you. Remember, like and subscribe, and go check out all the people that are commenting on my channel because they've got great content as well. So, till next time, this is my first 10 series car series I think I ever found all 10. Ah, oh, so beautiful. <laughs> so, till next time, my friend. Go find a Tesla on the shelf. The Cybertruck. Oh, I got other Teslas to show you too. Big Charlie gave them to me. So cool. I love that guy. He is fantastic. Go check out Big Charlie's garage. And let me tell you, he and I got to go peg hunting. <laughs> More on that in a later video. So thanks for coming in to a toy car case event at Johnny Roman Supper Club. Remember, life does not start till after 316. So, till next time, as always, rock on, my babies! <laughs> rock on! Do you take them out of the package or not? Oh! I can't. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> I know you're a toy car case guy out there. It is 316 on old Johnny Clark. Let's see what pulled into our parking lot. Hit that subscribe button and you won't miss out. Don't you wish you had that? This is the place to be!